let me address the counter-argument. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe AI will find massive new revenue sources. Maybe businesses will start paying billions for AI services. Maybe consumer adoption will explode and everyone will subscribe to multiple AI products. It's possible. But here's why I don't think it happens. The use cases are limited. Yes, AI can write emails, generate images, summarize documents, write code. But once you have one AI that does these things, why do you need five? You don't. The market consolidates around one or two winners, and the rest get nothing. The enterprise use cases are also limited. Most companies don't need custom AI models. They need integration with existing systems. And that's services revenue, not product revenue. Services don't scale the way products do. You can't sell services to millions of businesses with minimal marginal cost. Each integration requires custom work. This limits profitability. So even if businesses adopt AI widely, the revenue doesn't scale fast enough to justify the infrastructure spending. Another counterargument is that AI will get cheaper. Moore's law suggests compute gets cheaper over time, so maybe the costs drop and profitability improves. This is possible, but it's not happening fast enough. Yes, Nvidia's new Blackwell chips are more efficient than 8100s, but they also cost more. The net cost reduction is maybe 20 to 30% per query. That helps, but doesn't solve the problem. And it's offset by models getting bigger. GPT-5 will cost more to run than GPT-4, even with better chips. The final counterargument is AGI, artificial general intelligence. The idea that AI will become so capable it can do anything a human can do intellectually. If that happens, the revenue potential is unlimited. Every knowledge worker job gets replaced. That's trillions in labor costs that could become AI revenue. But there are two problems. First, we're not close to AGI. Despite the hype, current AI is narrow. It's good at specific tasks. It can't reason like humans, can't plan long-term, can't truly understand context. AGI might be 10 years away, it might be 50, nobody knows. And you can't base trillion dollar investments on technology that might not arrive for decades. Second, even if AGI comes, the economic model is unclear. If AI can do any knowledge work, who pays for it? If it replaces workers, those workers don't have income to buy products. The economy contracts. This is the automation paradox. Technology that eliminates jobs can destroy the market for itself. So AGI might not be the revenue bonanza investors hope for. It might be an economic crisis that requires fundamental restructuring of how society works. Not something that generates trillions in subscription revenue for tech companies.